The Avs, man, that's the big story of the day. They're just one win away. They win tonight. They win their third Stanley Cup in franchise history. Um, try not to get my hopes up, but it could be a wild, memorable night for all Avs fans, especially if you're up in Denver. My hopes are high. I've yeah. already picked out my outfit for tomorrow oh. morning for Anchorage. Oh boy! I'm gonna wear. I'm gonna wear the Avs maroon. Okay. I'm ready to go. I'm Let's ready to go. go. I'm saying it now. They're going to win. Right. Okay. I don't want to jinx it. All right. They're super if, sisters. If you're, if you're a betting man or woman, <laughs> take take There it word. is. There it is. <laughs> They're going to return to Denver tonight. They do have a 3-1 to one series lead over the defending champion, Tampa Bay Lightning. Let's send it over to our News Channel 13, Jessica Grunling, who is live from Ball Arena and lo knows a lot more about sports than I do. Good morning, Jess. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning, Riley. I mean, hey, heard it here first. Riley says abs will win, so I guess they're winning. But if you can take, you know, just a listen inside Ball Arena right now, it's silent. You can hear them, you know, replacing the advertisements on the ice right now. But that won't be the case come tonight because, like you guys said, the Avs are playing back in front of their home crowd. It's an obvious advantage, and they've played lights out here at Ball Arena all year long. And we're expecting nothing less tonight. As head coach Jared Bednar said, his team's playing with excitement, and the Lightning are playing in desperation. So it'll make for a great hockey game. They are coming off of that thrilling 3-2 overtime win with Nazem Kadri scoring the game winner after 20 turning from hand surgery. It was a back and forth affair that we didn't see in games two and three and the Avs had been good at enjoying moments like that and then moving on to the next game. But the Lightning have been resilient in their quest for a third straight title. They've already come back from a 3-2 series deficit in these playoffs and they started to show some improvement on their defense as this series has gone on. The Avs know they'll get the best of the Lightning tonight but say they have a group that believes. It's going to be the toughest one that we've had so far, like it, like every next game, basically. So um, we have to expect them to bring absolutely everything they have at us because it's, it's do or die. So um, we just have to be ready. They're going to come at us with new things. But at the end of the day, we, we trust uh, our team. We have a lot of belief. So. The Avalanche also have numbers in history in their favor. 3-1 leads hold up historically well. Squads leading 3-1 in Stanley, Stanley Cup playoff series have 289 wins and 329 series, including a 35-1 record in the Stanley Cup final. So odds looking good for them. And the mayor of Denver has declared today Burgundy and Blue Day. So everyone's pretty excited for this game five, you could say. Latest update on tickets, though. The cheapest ticket on Ticketmaster, $1,300. So uh, if you don't have that in your pocketbook, of course, you can watch the game from the comfort of your own home right here on KRDO News Channel 13. Puck drop is at 6 o'clock. Live from Ball Arena, Jessica Grunling, KRDO News Channel 13. Jessica.